Hello, Lojpanists. Today, I'm going to talk to you about Lo and Le. Lo and Le are the articles in Lojpan. I use them to make a description to, of something, a sumti, out of a celebrity. They both do basically the same thing grammatically. They take the the chachipa, the first argument of the selbri, and they make a sumti that refers to that. That's what they've always done. That's what they always will do. It's pretty simple. And the thing is, for some reason, we have two of them. Now, in order to understand what's gone on with lo and la, you need a little bit of history, I guess. Um, so, let's talk about how lo and la used to be. Now the thing is, one thing you have to understand about the point in history I'm going to tell you about is that nobody spoke Lojban back then. I mean, they wrote in Lojban occasionally. They'd write a few sentences here and there. They'd try to write stories or, or write essays but they wouldn't succeed very much and hardly anybody was able to at all and nobody like conversationally like hung out and spoke Lojban like we do on IRC and stuff um these days they like at first when we started to talk on IRC all the time uh people were like they were still saying like of course you know nobody's really speaking Lojban but theoretically when we do and we had to interrupt them and be like no we started speaking Lojban a while ago we've been speaking it but back when the old meanings of Lo and Le were around nobody really spoke Lojban they they just uh, argued about what it would be like if they were able to speak Lojban and part of the reason nobody spoke Lojban was the meanings of Lo and Le um, I'll just give you some of the, I mean, there were all different arguments, there were people had different ideas, they were arguing different positions about it, you know, so it was never like clear, there was never like a clear consensus about what they meant anyway, but, um, but I'll, I'll give, just give you a couple examples of what people thought they meant back then, so I'll give you an idea of what the problem was, okay? One of the one of the things that people thought about low um, was like low was just supposed to mean was just supposed to mean you're actually talking about the thing you're talking about, right? But the thing is, it was really weird about numbers. If you said lo shi gerku, the three dogs, oops. You accidentally said there are only three dogs in the entire universe. You didn't mean to say that, right? Um, why did it mean that? I don't know. Someone thought that made sense. So they said that's what lo and a number meant, like that, okay? So that's, and then on the other hand, we had le. Now le was what at the time people called non-veridical. They were always using that term non-veridical, and what that was supposed to mean was that le um, did not necessarily mean the thing you were saying. It wasn't really the chachipa, the, the first thing of the, of the celebrity. That was just a suggestion of what it might mean. Like, so you could talk about uh, a stuffed bear and call it le shribe, the bear, and it was okay that it wasn't really a bear because you were being non-veridical, okay? Which was kind of vague, but on the other hand, low, with low you definitely had to actually definitely mean whatever you said, right? So low, people were like scared of using low because they were like, do I actually mean what I'm saying? I gotta be really accurate if I use low or something. And if I accidentally say, low and a number and something, then I'm talking, I'm saying how many of that there are in the universe. So people felt like low was dangerous. And pretty much if we tried to get people to speak Lojban back then, what we did was tell them just use le. 
Now, le, you could be, it would be kind of vague, maybe it was non-veridical, but pretty much everyone would understand what you meant. You could get away with it. If it wasn't right, you'd be like, oh, I was just being non-veridical. Yeah, that's it. So, so back then our advice was always use le. And basically people just used le. Now, then there was a change. We decided, hey, that doesn't make any sense. The way we've been using the articles doesn't make any sense at all. We should try to make some sense. So we came up with a new system. It's called Horlo, which is not a gizmo. It's a, it's a word that combines Jorges and, and Lo. It's an English word, Horlo. And so we made up this new way that articles work in Lajban. So, everyone, I mean, basically what we agree is that Horlo is the way it works now. That's what Horlo means. It means the idea we have now about articles. And the idea we have about articles now is actually pretty simple. What's confusing is that we keep explaining it. I mean, it's like people get taught the old way and then they have to be untaught, so it's confusing, right? But really the new way articles work is pretty simple. Um, everything is pretty much veridical, whatever that means. It all You, you pretty much mean what you say. Um, but you can... It's, it, it is allowed in modern Lojban to, to be metaphorical without necessarily saying peha. It's kind of, it's more specific and accurate and, and formal and careful if you say peha. The thing I just said is metaphorical. But it, it, you know, if you're writing a poem or something, you don't have to say peha after every single sentence. You can get away with, with just saying peha when it's unexpected that something's metaphorical or not, not exact. So, um, so both of them, you mean what you're saying, you mean the chachipa, you mean the first thing in the celebrity. Um, what... So, lo just means something that would fit in that first place of the celebrity. That's basically all it means. And that's basically all we need. I mean, Lojman should just have one article. That would... <laughs> That wouldn't confuse anybody. But we happen to have this other article, right? So what le means, we don't talk so much about non-veridical anymore. What le means is that you're given a description of something. So the idea with le is that you have a particular something in mind, right? There's something that you're describing and you're using le to say, this is my description of the thing, is that it's the kind of thing that fits in this chachipa. So, um, so like, I mean, you don't always have to have a particular thing in mind if you're, if you're talking about something. Like, you could say, mi nelshi lo nu mi shitka lo badna. And that could mean, you know, I, that means I like that I eat, or that, um, I like eating bananas, or a banana, or the banana, right? But you don't have to have a particular banana in mind, right? Mi shit kilo badna. I ate a banana doesn't mean to, I don't, I'm just saying it right now and I don't have any particular banana in mind, you know, right? So I'm just talking about in general eating bananas. So you can use low for that sort of thing. Actually, you can use low for anything. Just say low, okay? <laughs> that's, that's my advice to you. Nintadni, new, new students, just use low. But if you want to use le, since we have it, hanging around, then what you should do to use le is uh, you use le when you have something in particular you want to describe. Like if I want to talk about this pretty tree over here, its leaves are turning red, I could say le hun red, the red thing, or le trishu, and be talking about that particular one. That's, that's all it really means now. It's pretty simple. It should be simple. Um, sorry it's not simple. Sorry our old, all our old stuff is us old ideas about non-veridical and the three dogs that exist in the whole universe. 
you don't need to worry about all that stuff. I mean, basically, you never needed to worry about it. It was always just the confusion. All you ever needed to do was you used to have to use le because there were weird shit you needed to worry about with lo. And nowadays, you always can use lo, and you don't even need to worry about le. So, so don't worry about it. It's fine. You can learn from the complete Lojman language. You will, you will be understood. You'll get it. You'll get what we're talking about. It's fine. It works. And that's, that's my contribution for today to the ongoing low le controversy situation. I hope, I hope that helped you understand what's going on. Shoho.